former palaces built by the czars, the nobles, and the wealthy merchants are still places of magnificent beauty. Today in Lidvadia, the late czar's palace is a sanatorium. Every villa in this vacation land has its quota of guests the year round and from all corners of the Soviet Union. This palatial fortress was built for the Grand Duke Dmitri. The beautiful white increment stone glistens like a jewel. The setting is a huge park cut through by picturesque ravines and guarded by junipers covered with pampas grass. We approach now the former home of the Grand Duke Nikolai Nikolaevich at Gaspra. Look at the beauty of this magnificent landscape garden. Its winding paths and its creeping vines arching over most of the walls and completely surrounded by superb natural parks. In these wonder spots of beauty we also find the Russian adaptation of American recreations Handball, tennis, and croquet being enjoyed by the many who spend their vacation here. Passing Cape Ai Todor on our way to Alupka, we involuntarily catch our breath. We see one of the much talked of sites of Russia called Swallow's Nest. It's a villa that literally overhangs the waves on the top of an abrupt cliff. Two things appeal to us, the beauty of the buildings and the boldness of the builders. It is a castle that nestles on an ancient stone like a swallow on its nest. This and the fact that thousands of swallows actually do make their homes here gives it its name.